Hello, my name is Free Habit Dolphin, and today I bring you 21 tips for Cataclysma, brand new city building strategy game. I split tips in three parts. For other ones, I will leave a link to playlist in the description down below and on the end screen. If they are not out yet, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to not miss them. And now let's jump to the tips. In this video, I share beginner tips. They might be easier to use or find, but nevertheless are essential for strong game. So the first tip is to build no extra walls. These walls on the left will level up if I place another block on top of them. After leveling up, they will get extra HP. Now we have 96, 240 and 480. And of course, again, removing that extra block would make HP the same, even though one wall is higher than another. So any additional block does not make them stronger and you should not waste your resources if you can't level up yet. You should follow this even more because leveling up corresponds well to unit bonuses for crit chances. The next tip, no double walls. As I started to play, if I wanted to put some extra things on the wall, such as banners, usually I would just start building another wall nearby. But you don't have to and should not do this. Just use those extra half arch blocks that extend floor to the one or many directions without additional structures. The third tip, use shortcut keys. There are many of them, for example, I love to quickly see HP of objects with Alt key and show different structures or what I call filters with that key. It's especially useful when you're building something or looking for a place and you don't want to see trees everywhere or any other stuff. So those things can make your life much easier, you just have to look it up. Fourth tip, mind the path. Cataclysma is not only city builder but resource management game as well. So where you place your buildings can directly influence your success in the game. Some buildings don't care how distant they are from the citadel, but for some it changes their productivity because of longer paths. So try deliberately place path independent buildings, like barracks for example, far away, and leave space for path dependent buildings near the center. To have a good game, you have to manage well not only resources or path, but the space itself. Defense full space is limited, so you need to stack your buildings to use that third axis. Good thing is that if you don't go extra extra high, you also mine the path by making it not much longer. To save precious resources, use them differently. While building defenses, use stone for defensive wall, but for stairs and space for units, use wood. Also remember from the first tip to never put extra stone block after max level, so use wood to support roofs as well. Before the last tip, I will tell you a secret, but you already have seen two hidden tips, but I will share in next videos. Guess what those have been in the comments down below and check your answer later. And the last tip is to get extra health early on in campaign while unlocking Bowman's ability, yeah. Menelaus Shot. It lets Bowman to shoot many arrows at once and this scales really well because they're cheap to make. And that's all tips in this video, thank you for watching and don't miss other parts.